Alabama senior has hired Andre Griffin as the new varsity football coach. Son of two-time Heisman Trophy winner Archie Griffin, Andre played at Ohio State as well and has spent the last decade as an assistant football coach. First at Capital University for the last eight seasons at Saginaw Valley State. He's excited to take over the resurgent Spartans and be back home. Um, I think it's a great place to be. Tradition is really good, and uh, Coach Fell did a great job, so I think it's the right opportunity for me at this point. I always wanted to uh, be a head coach, and the uh, last two, three years, I've been preparing for it, so definitely, um, and I think a big school is always good. Yes, my wife is actually, uh, she's a graduate from Lima. She's a former uh, basketball player, and uh, I learned a lot of stuff from there. We went to basketball games over break, and, uh, you know, big fan of Lima, and, and, you know, we go back and forth a little bit. I'm, I'm from Northeast Ohio slash Columbus. I went to Shaker Heights, and uh, they almost met in basketball last year, if you guys can remember, but uh, unfortunately, both teams lost. But, uh, um, you know, I think with the Lima and knowing where they come from and my, and my in-laws, you know, I know a lot about Lima. You know, my dad is a great, great dad, uh, first and foremost. Um, he's, he's ecstatic that I'm a head coach. He was not a coach, so I'm going my own way. And uh, so he's happy for me, just like my in-laws and my mom and dad and everybody else in my family. So right now, he's just a happy dad. Griffin will officially take over on March 30th. He'll be in the building every day, and the first time head coach plans on being aggressive to keep the Spartans back on top. We're going to be fundamentally sound, um, aggressive offensively. Um, I know you guys are used to that. Uh, we're going to be aggressive defensively and very sound in the special teams, and we're going to be very disciplined. You know, if we do that um, we're go week by week, um, we have a chance at the end of the week. We want to we want to get them aggressively involved in the, in the off season and continue. You know, and that's part of um, running some offense that uh, they have in the back. And uh, I think we can continue to be great. And uh, week by week, it's a fundamentally thing, but it's a process at the same thing, at the same time. And uh, I think we're going to be good. Our approach putting the staff together is, um, you know, getting to know the coaches that's here. Um, you know, trying to get a defensive coordinator that's um, what I want to coach, um, and then get loyalty. You know, loyalty is a big thing for me. Um, and the kids, you know, they have to be great with the kids. Um, if they're not, not great with the kids, then, you know, we have to move forward. But uh, um, mentoring, you know, it's not all about just, just coaching football. You know, they got to be able to mentor the, the kids and uh, teach them, you know, life lessons and, and be a father figure to the kids. They're ready to go, um, you know, ready to go. And, uh, and I told them I got them, got them fired up a little bit. Uh, when we get back, we're going to be aggressive in the weight room, you know, off the field. Um, and also with camps and stuff like that in the summer. So I think they're ready to go. And with a winning program coming back, you know, they, they know how to win. And uh, it's just my job to carry them to the uh, next level. At Lima Senior, Mark Kuntz, Sports Report.